Hello everybody. Hopefully i am got this somewhat focused. I've got the sun glaring in at me. Oh, oh there, that's better. Uh, a few things about automation. We, you know, I work retail. I'm wondering if, you know, uh, self-checkout is becoming more and more. I went to Taco Bell. There's my camera. I went to Taco Bell uh, the other day put my order in on the screen and it was ready for me and they had people all working back there but no one was able to take the order at the counter you had to go to the screens one of which was on the fritz so that did cause a block up uh to utilize the bathroom which they did have one you had to tell the person at the counter and they had to push a button to let you in. Water is automated. If there's a sensor, you have to break the light sensor. Uh, soap, the same way. The towels, wave your hand. If the electricity goes, how is all this going to work? Uh, so, and moreover, I'm in a rental car. My car is in the shop. And this car has an automatic turnoff when you're at a stoplight. I've driven a car like this one time before. I heard it go to chunk. I was at a stoplight. I freaked out. Kept my foot on the brake because I was still in drive, like a normal human being. And then when the light changed, I tentatively, tentatively took my foot off the brake and all of a sudden the car roared to life. Yes, I'm used to cars that if they chug and stop, there's something wrong with the engine. You're out of gas, something. Not, oh, this is a gas-saving device, and when that light changes and you tap on the gas or take your foot off the brake, it's going to go forward. There is a piece of technology I never want to experience, but I'll be experiencing it for the next three days in this car until I find out Monday what happened to my car. We kind of know. We're just going to have to find out how much it's going to cost to fix it and how long it'll take to fix it. Um, looking at all the new things that are happening with every store you go into, and I'm going to go in Trader Joe's today. I'm probably going to do a little footage, separate video, because we know that when I pause it, I don't actually connect it properly sometimes. But I want to see if they have self-checkout at Trader Joe's. I'm just curious to find out. Uh... My local secondhand store uh, has uh, self-checkout. It's all self-checkout. I think they have one register, just in case there's something weird or there's a return or somebody actually needs a human being. Uh, Goodwills are now going to uh, self-checkout, although I have not seen that in any that I've been in. So looking at all this automation that's supposed to make our lives easier. You know, cashless society, everyone has a card now. There are pros and cons to this. When you don't have a checker actually earning a wage to ring you up, do they get another position? Hopefully they do get another position in the store. I do know that Walmart and other stores, when they have self-checkout, they have somebody monitoring that area because human errors do happen, and you need a human to fix those. Um, your thoughts on this? It's, are we going too far? Are we, taking, are we taking people and human contact out of the equation to such a point that we, you know, what, in two generations, would, would we know how to fo function if we had to go back to the old ways? I mean, you basically have 80-year-old grandmas going, oh, I remember this. You go to that human and you get rung up. You know, I, I know that's extreme, but seriously, how far do we go with automation before, you know, what, what else are people going to do? So that's my thoughts. Uh, give this a watch. If you're a returning subscriber, thank you. If you're new, yeah, the channel kind of has some of this weird stuff on it. I'm not going to lie to you. 
Uh, and yes, I did take my glasses off so we didn't have glare coming in through the window. But I will, I will go through Trader Joe's and uh, tell you what I see and don't see. It's, you know, it's one of those higher end stores. It's, it's kind of my specialty store, like once every two months. I go pick up certain things and then I'm good for two months. <clears throat> and then I shop at Winco like a normal human being. So uh, I will show you that uh, along with this one. And uh, hope to see you again soon. Bye.